MotorScores.com. Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about something that, that I came across. As you know, I probably get targeted with more coding ads than anything else. And I, I like to check them out because I'm interested about the space. And uh, I came across this triple byte, which through a Facebook ad, I think. And it was, I checked it out, and I'm really impressed with what it is. So a lot of us struggle with getting our first job. A lot of us are concerned about not having a CS degree, not having resume experience, and getting a job at one of the major companies or a job at all. So Triple Byte kind of addresses that to, to a degree. They're an online recruiting agency in which you take a test, uh, a programming quiz, and then you do some programming problems, and then you have a technical interview. But you do all this, and what makes them really unique is, one, you don't submit any resume experience, and you don't submit any education. It's literally just completely based off the skills. And uh, they have over 200 companies that they're hiring with. And hopefully you'll get an offer, but they, they have a higher hiring rate than most. And you can see that these aren't like, you know, Joe Schmo's web design. They're Dropbox, Facebook, uh, Apple, a bunch of different ones. Twitch. I'd love to work at Twitch. <laughs> that would be a dream come true. Um, YouTube probably first. But Reddit, a lot of big companies that you that you would recognize Coursera and people are you know all you do so so it's by the way it's completely free I don't want you to think that I'm trying to sell you anything or anything like that but how it works and if you're interested on, on my website coderscourse.com I actually document one of the tests that I go through to kind of see okay well this is the first one this is the programming quiz and it's essentially how the first part goes is First, you choose what type of developer you want to be. Essentially, uh, you have the general developer questions, which is, hey, I've never worked as a develop developer. And that's what I chose just because I wanted to work my way through all three. But uh, once you choose one, just be aware, that's kind of where you're going. Because uh, so far, I haven't been able to go and go back and change to the the web developer or front-end developer path. But the way it goes, so you have the general developer, which is, I would imagine you're a recent college student or you're a self-taught developer and you're trying to break into the industry, that's the test for you. You have the front-end developer that's web development based. Uh, that I don't know how that is, but I imagine it goes somewhat similar to the, the test I took. And then you have the mobile developer as well. So you have three different paths depending on where you're in in your career. The front end and the mobile are for if you already have some experience or you already worked and you're maybe trying to get a new job or you're trying to check something else out. But essentially what happens is you get a question, you get, uh, at least in the, the general one, you go through 30 questions. I think it may have been 35. And it's just A, B, C, and D questions, sort of, hey, uh, in this situation, what would you do? In this situation, what would you do? What's wrong with this situation? You might get some code. And it, it, was, it was very intriguing because the code would be in like five, six, seven different languages. But if you are a semi-experienced developer or coder, you can piece it together. It's not very complicated stuff like for loops with stuff missing, what what piece of code is missing, stuff like that. So, something that you should be able to piece together. And the next thing is after you do that, you then choose, uh, it, for me it was four algorithms. They give you four algorithms and a short period of time. And they're not the most complicated algorithms, but they are about a five to seven, maybe nine minutes at a time for each algorithm. So they're bam, 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 bam. They're time-based. I actually ran out on the last one. I was like a minute away from solving it. I couldn't solve my issue. And so I was trying to beat the clock and I literally, oh, I, I didn't get it. Uh, but all, but after that, you go on to the technical interview stage. I haven't done that yet uh, myself. But for people who are really concerned, who are good developers or aspiring to be a developer, and they don't have that computer science degree, they don't have an engineering degree, they don't have relevant resume experience, right? Like, if you go three jobs back, I was working at Domino's. I was, uh, or unemployed, depending on what part in time it was. So you may be in that situation, and Triple Byte is a cool way for you to say, hey, I've been working my ass off, I've been out there grinding it out, I can solve algorithms, I can build web pages, whatever it is, if you're if you are a developer and you just can't get that job, Triple Byte might be able to solve that because they they literally never in the process does a does a uh, employer get a resume, never in the process do they get education, work experience. It's all based off your skills, and it's it's beautiful. I I love everything about that because I think a lot of times people qualified candidates are getting filtered out 
and it's really hard to get your foot in the door. If you guys are interested in it, I'll include a link down below. It's uh, check it out. If you get a job, I get some money, which, so that's cool. Uh, but but uh, if you don't, at least you get to see what skills tests are out there, how to how to kind of what to actually expect because it's pretty realistic. I mean, the algorithms were a little bit on the easier end because you only had a shorter amount of time to deal with them. But I imagine that uh, they'll pick up the pace down down the road if if maybe I did the one with the developer experience, which as I should have, right? But uh, as always, guys, thank you for for checking out the video. I definitely encourage you to check out Triple Byte. There'll be a link in the comments and there'll be a link in the description and I'm sure other places as well. If you're interested in uh, checking them out, I, I encourage it. I, I, I definitely think it will, even if even if you don't think you're ready, I think it'll, it'll, you'll, it'll give you some perspective about what it takes to be ready, right? Because they are trying to get you jobs. That's their job is to get you a job at the end of the day and they don't care about your education they don't care about your and I, that's not saying by the way because sometimes when you say they don't care about your education or your resume experience that doesn't mean that it's not worth anything all i'm saying is that it's a great it's it's it puts everybody on an even playing field if you don't have education you don't have resume experience to those who do it puts you all right cool let's see where you're actually at and I, that's what i like about it because I, I know there's a lot of good developers out there who can't get that break, and I, I think Triple Byte will help you out. So check them out, guys. As always, if you want to see me struggle through the quizzes, and you know, don't worry, you're not going to get the same one. I'm sure they have thousands of questions. You can on my website, coderscourse.com, along with a, a bunch of other stuff. Thank you for watching. Join our Facebook group, 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 Code Tech and Caffeine. And the keyword for, for today for a free course giveaway uh, will probably be an Angular 2 course. It'll be some course. All courses are great courses. Will be Byte. B-Y-T-E. B-I-T-E -E is also cool. So that will be the, the keyword for the giveaway. As always, guys, thank you for watching. Support me on Patreon, all that good stuff. I'll see you next time. Hey, guys, thanks for watching the video. Special thanks to our sponsors, Dev Mountain. If you're looking for a coding boot camp where tuition and housing is included, definitely check them out. Appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video.